What's going on, YouTube family? Welcome back to Codename the Wolfman. I'm the Wolfman. Thank you for tuning in. I uh, wanted to give you all a quick update today, something I came across a few days ago that I thought was pretty cool, and I thought it'd be nice to go ahead and share it with the YouTube family. So again, thank you for tuning in. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you have, welcome back to the channel. So uh, one thing that I came across recently uh, was in the online community, and I highly recommend that you guys get into communities if you aren't into them, um, whether it's video gaming, crypto, anything that you're into, the internet allows us the possibility to have these online communities and communicate with other people with like minds just like us. So uh, it always helps in the long run. But what I came across in the XRP community is an upcoming airdrop for Evernote, guys. So I uh, just want to make sure that people are aware of that. Uh, maybe a year or so ago, there were some other airdrops, a lot of airdrops that came out in the XRP ledger. One thing I want to say before even getting into the airdrops is be very careful because in crypto, is there's a wide range of scams that go on. And a lot of scams revolve around these airdrops or around airdrops in general. Uh, just to give you an example, a lot of times in my uh, in my DMs on Twitter or on other social medias, you'll get messages from someone claiming to be an admin for the project uh, or a developer for the project, and they'll send you a message like, hey, our airdrop is live. Please go to such and such website and, and get your free airdrop. And all they're doing is trying to fish. They're trying to get information from you, one. Two, they're trying to steal your tokens from you by having you interact, interact with some type of um, – smart uh contract that is not legitimate so right now again crypto is wide open with different types of scams i'll say it's a scammer's paradise for those people familiar with coding and smart contracts but just be aware of that so um wh what i was saying was though uh, maybe a year or so ago uh the xrp ledger while they were still under scrutiny from the sec they actually uh, has something called trust lines, which I haven't seen with other cryptos, but it basically gives you a chance to um, connect or say that you trust different companies that are going to be working on the XRP ledger. And in, in return for that trust, they'll give you free tokens just to say, hey, you want to be a part of our community, you trust us, here's some free tokens for you, which came in the form of an airdrop as long as you had trust lines. Now, the good thing about Evernote, I just came across this, September the 1st, they're going to be doing their airdrop. What Evernote is, is a company that works alongside the XRP ledger. So they're basically going to be providing the layer two or the uh, web three aspect that allows smart contracts to run on the XRP ledger. Um, now, what's unique about these smart contracts is they're not just limited to the financial space. So any type of idea you have, no matter how eccentric it may be, you will be able to deploy these smart contracts using the Evernode um, platform. So that's what's so good about them. Now, the other thing is uh, I'm going to show you their website shortly here, or at least I'm going to show you their Twitter profile, and we'll go ahead and just jump over there. But the good thing about them is they're aware of how these scams work. So if you look over their profile, they're automatically letting you know, no, we don't have any um, any type of support. You know, no, we won't reach out to you, which most good, good um, companies will do. They'll let you know, hey, we're not reaching out to you. We're not doing any of that stuff because there's already scams around this airdrop where people are trying to reach out and act as if they are ever know. But just know they don't reach out to you. You know, you would do all the reaching out and they're not reaching out to you in any form or aspect. Um, so I think they know about these type of things. They're not giving out a whole bunch of information. But the way it's going to work, uh, at least for me, because this is my personal crypto journey and how I'm going to get the money or how I'm going to get these free tokens. Everybody I know, they love free. So how this is all the, all you need to do is hold XRP on a on a uh, wallet that can be seen by the XRP ledger, because what they'll do is do a snapshot on September 1st. And as long as you have XRP and I want to say up to 50,000 XRP, then you will get. Uh, you will get an airdrop of Evernote tokens. And so they're very vague on the amount of tokens. Uh, they're not going into all of that, like how much you're going to get and all this type of stuff. 
they're just telling you that as long as you hold this on a public wallet, such as Zum, for uh, example, if you have XUMM Zum wallet and you hold XRP, a snapshot will be taken to prove that you have the XRP, and then you will get an airdrop potentially of Evernote. Now, why was this beneficial to me in the past? When I got those other airdrops, I was a little bit late to the party, honestly, but I did um, receive some airdrops. And even if I didn't necessarily believe in those companies that sent me airdrops, as long as there was some um, form of speculation or there was some uh, hope that those tokens were going to be worth something, they actually did generate some, some price. They did have some price action and they did become worth some money. Um, uh, one, one of which was the X punks. Everybody wanted to get an X punk. Uh, people were trading in the tokens to get an X punk, but they came initially in the form of a trust line and the airdrop. Now, what I did was I used that to pad my XRP bag because I wasn't really familiar with those companies, but I wasn't going to argue with getting something for free. So once I got those free to tokens and they generated, you know, some price action, I just went ahead and swapped them over for more XRP just so I can have more XRP because I'm very bullish on it, as you can see. And, um, you know, I still think that is very undervalued. So on the Evernote side of things, uh, you can see they're announcing that they're going to have the airdrop coming up. Uh, they're telling you what they are composed of just to drop down. Uh, again, this goes over in the simplest form. They dropped this on August 12th is on september 1st hold your xrp in an off exchange account you control through zum wallet or a similar non-custodial wallet option do nothing further instructions will follow when the side chain is launched so they're going to have a, a side chain launch side by side to the xrpl and then that's where you'll receive those tokens uh, but basically they're saying all you need to do is hold xrp in an off exchange account like a zum wallet for example as long as you hold it there, and once they take the snapshot, when their side chain launches, that's when you will receive the airdrop. So it's pretty simple. Um, you don't need to have a trust line. You don't need to go through anybody. So, again, if, if people are reaching out to you or saying they have all these airdrops or, you know, especially in response to Evernote, know that Evernote has no support, and they don't require you to do anything except hold XRP. Uh, so I thought that was super cool. Something that you can do to get free tokens, something I'm going to do to get free tokens, it's up to you to be your own uh, financial manager because I'm not a financial manager, so it's not financial advice. But again, for everyone, I appreciate you coming to the channel. And thank you for the likes and the subscriptions. Uh, please do share with a friend, and uh, we'll be back for more. So thank you, guys. See you later.